師傅，依個炸魚皮同埋一個鳳爪，唔該曬，麻煩你。哇 ，nice！ 嗱 ，this is 炸魚皮 ，and this is 咧鳳爪 ，perfect with champagne too。Nice happy broth. Yeah. Very nice. fragrant. Wonderful. Today we all got some very texturally minded food. Crispy fish skin. Slightly gelatinous uh, chicken feet. What we're really playing with here is the combination of two textures. And I think that by the time we combine the chicken feet, champagne, fish skin, champagne, you will see exactly what I mean. Mmm. Oh, it's me. You see how the bubbles completely occupies your, your palate. And you've got this lovely assertiveness from the fish skin that combines very well. It kind of mellows it a little bit, but it still makes its presence felt really quite distinctively. And I think that's why it is a good combination. And this is where we're really lucky in Hong Kong, where we have the delicious West and the Thirsty East combining together. Great Chinese food with some of the best vintages uh, from Europe. And if you taste the wine with the chicken feet, yes. The texture, I mean, it's very gelatinous, um, goes well with the uh, the full body of the champagne. So I, uh, I, I certainly see that it's a uh, you know, good match with the champagne. Well, well done, Tim. There isn't a larger perceived quality difference between fine champagne and chicken foot. And yet, they work together. Good tastes have absolutely no boundaries. So today what we have is a light and fragrant red wine from the Volnay village in Burgundy. Let's give it a gentle swirl. And I think that it's also very interesting too, is that today we're in a humble eatery and we're drinking wine out of plastic cups, which I think some friends out there would be, yeah. really, are you serious? The idea is that if the glass doesn't leak, then it's okay, right? Wow, <laughs> So we have some uh, honeycomb tripe, some wonton here, and of course the garnish typical, we have fried garlic, and then also some spring onion. And this, it is a fish quenelle. Very nice. Yeah. Oh, so, I think that works. Yeah, it does work. Yeah. So a wine that's light in tannins and goes quite well with, with the fish balls, yeah. Old wine deserves all the respect and the royal treatment. And that is actually a lot of what we do as well, which is making sure when we bring wine forward for an auction that the wines have been taken care of. The wines have got strong provenance. The ideal pairing is actually one that is shared with families and friends and everything else really is just too technical. Eating, drinking, food and wine and sharing is just the absolute joy. I'm Simon Tam, head of wine at Christie's and I share good tastes. <laughs>